Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome everybody to another episode of my 100% walkthrough of Fallout 4. I hope everybody's doing well. I know that I am. And today, we are going to be grabbing up a few magazines and tying up some loose ends. So without further ado, let's go ahead and put some points into our level. And then we'll get started with the video. I know I said I was going to put the last two into gun nut and armor. But I'm not really that worried about it right now. So I'm going to put two into luck and then start working on bloody mess. Now. Let's go ahead and start making our way through, uh, I want to say it's South Boston. I'm not too sure. By the way, for those of you that don't know where we're at, we started at Egret Tours Marina and we just walked up the road here and we're heading over here to the Milton General Hospital. We're not going inside there, but we're going in this little section. I think it is South Boston. I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Once we start getting a little closer, though, we are going to crouch. There's a few super mutants. Normally, there's some suiciders as well mixed into the pack speaking of which oh I thought that one that was walking in front of us was a suicider what? no way Damn. Get some. Oh, another one? <laughs> I love doing that. I, I have no clue why that is so satisfying to me. But it is. Oh my god. Another one? Didn't expect three of them. Expected one at least. But not three. Be careful, everybody that's coming through here. Apparently, there's uh, three suicider super mutants. I am unstoppable! Well, looks like you're dead, so you weren't that unstoppable. The last two are over there. We'll go over there in a little bit. Right now, we want to come over here. I think I hear the Brotherhood of Steel. Let's hope that we don't have a repeat of what happened last time. Oh, you can get into Vault 88 from here? No shit. Didn't know that. Well, if anybody wants to get to Vault 88, <laughs> there you go. You can get to Vault 88 through that sewer drain. We're going to turn on our pit boy because reasons. I don't see a thing in here. No, no, we cannot. Not without a pit boy. Well, okay. We want to press one and then three, and that'll open up all of these doors. Gotta see what's inside this place. Oh my god, what the hell is going on? I don't know what I did to disturb these fools, but there is a lot of nonsense going on right now. I'm just gonna disarm all of these and grab the grenades, 
but I'm not going to do all of it for every single um, one. I was like, wait, did the grenades already fall or something? But then again, like, I would have heard it. Did I miss one? I did. Be careful. Again, if your sneak isn't high and you still trigger traps, right here is a nasty one because there's a rocket launcher right over there that will shoot this car. It'll blow up in your face. And nobody likes that. Oh, was it the... The roaches? Huh. The roaches, I guess, uh, set off the fire Find over them. here. Find them! Now that's what I call a confirmed kill. It, it's a rad roach, bud. Don't give yourself too many props. We're going to get to where there's a bunch of ghouls. We want to be careful for them because they'll swarm you really, really quick. Speaking of which, I put some Radex on because obviously ghouls <coughs> radiate you. Oh my goodness. Listen here, fool. Wow, one shot. Ooh, and we got another level. Awesome. Jesus, where are you all coming from? Somewhere. Let's put in another level. We're going to put it straight into bloody mess. And I think what we're going to do is only put two more into bloody mess. And then we'll work on the uh, gun nut and armor. There's, I think this is where all the ghouls came from. I don't know for sure. Just because they're always already out. By the time I'm coming through here. Which maybe they previously escaped. Who knows? Who knows? Jeez, McCready, get off my ass, bud. Um. So, again, I'm just disarming these. There's a ton of Tesla traps here. You're more than welcome to disarm them. Sorry if I'm panning a little fast, making anybody dizzy. Hopefully I'm not. We'll open this up for funsies. We're not going to go through it. We're just opening it up. Three and one are traps. We want to go through two. Mannequin's going to fall on us. I don't... Oh, yeah. I should probably show this off. Trap. Well, trip wire. Trip wire. And then a makeshift bomb, which is the trap. So be careful. If we come around this way... We can go in here, pick ourselves up a hot rod nice. or a magazine. You're going to read that now? What if I am, McCready? What if I am? Bunch of stuff to loot if you want. It's up to you. Just going to grab a few Don't things and then... Who or what just left here. Yep. So there's two um, doors you can choose. This one, if you're low on meds or you like meds, good. Uh, I find this one to be more useful. There's four fusion cores in there. And, oh, I'm an idiot. Why'd I just do that? Well, I guess uh, we're not getting the fusion cores. <laughs> oh, I'm so stupid. I, I literally just said, hey, I like to do this one. And then I did the opposite. I didn't mean to 
press the button. But I did. But I did. So. Um, oh, over here. If we go this way. Come around. I thought there was a trap there. We can unbar these, maybe. Um, and come up top. There's two ways to go. You can go down that way and go into Milton uh, General Hospital, I believe. Also, some of those houses over there you can loot. If you're feeling up to it. What is smoking over there? Huh. Did a vertebird crash? I think a vertebird crashed. But we want to go over here. You can go to the top of... I think this is Fallon's um, store or something. Uh, you can go to the top there. There's some loot. I believe you can get um, into the Fallon shop from up top as well. Who was that? Your death, bud. That's what this is. Daffo. Da Let's go inside uh, Fallon's. Fallon's department store. All right, I was right. Hey, I never got a chance to properly thank you for helping me take out Winlock and Barnes. We're friends. No thanks necessary. Well, I wanted to say it anyway. You stuck your neck out for me. I don't forget sh I mean, things like that. Cursing doesn't offend me, you know. I didn't think it did. It's not about you, it's about a promise I made. When I left the Capital Wasteland, I didn't just leave little Lamplight behind. I left my family behind. I had a beautiful wife named Lucy, and a son we named Duncan. He's the one I made my promise to. I promised to clean up my act and to be a better person. I guess that sounds pretty stupid coming from a guy who shoots people for a living. You must have had a good reason to leave them behind. That's what I keep telling myself. My son, he's sick. I, I, I don't know what's wrong with him. One day he's playing out in the fields behind our farm. The next he took a fever and these blue boils popped up all over his body. Last I saw, he was almost too weak to walk. I didn't dare ask him to come with me. Honestly, I don't know how much longer he's going to last. There must be something we can do. I was hoping you'd say that. A few months before we met, I bumped into a guy named Sinclair who claimed his buddy caught some kind of disease. I thought he was wasting my time until he said his partner broke out in blue boils. They dug up information about a cure at a place called MedTech Research. They even managed to grab the building's lockdown security codes. Unfortunately, Sinclair's buddy died before they were able to break into the facility. I mean, there's no way that's a coincidence, right? MedTech has to be the place. Don't give up hope. If there's a cure, we'll find it. Thanks, partner. I'll put MedTech research on your map. When you're ready, just take us out there. I have all the codes we need to get through their security. What you're doing. No one's ever cared that much about me before, even if it takes me the rest of my life. I'll repay this debt to you. I swear it. Let's crouch again. We're gonna... Oh, for some reason, I guess it's just that bright over there. Oh, there's lights. That's why. You can lockpick this safe if you like. It's master. I'm not going to bother right. with it. I heard they had a two for one sale in the men's department. But just be careful. Lots of super mutants in here. What you say is dead. Getting hungry. Oh wow, Super Mutant Master? Okay. See, I thought there was one over there. <laughs> we want to be careful for that guy right there, too. So stupid! So weak! 
Ah, stupid super mutant hounds. Let's go into our pit boy and heal ourselves. Wait. Oh my god. Come in front of me so I can kill you. <laughs> Find anything useful on him? Mm, just ammunition, but Yes. There we go. We got a new hairstyle. Let's get the hell up out of Fallon's. Also, if you're having a little bit of trouble, you can hack the terminal over there and have the Protectron help you out. I don't ever feel like I need the help from the Protectron just because it seems like they die so easily when trying to help you. So it's almost not necessary. We're almost finished with... McCready's no, side quest I'm stuff not. or companion Watch quests. <laughs> Let's go outside. Now we're going to go to the metro station over here. I think there's a super mutant over here. That was stupid of me to keep looting when I was being shot at, but oh well, right? Nice death claw hand. Let's crouch and go inside the West uh, Roxbury Station. Wish a bucket head would show up. I hear something. There's one more. Yeah, I knew he was right over here. Can't escape me. Bring it on. Over here is a tension trigger trap. And that is fucking horrible. That, that would be a shitty way to die. And then the makeshift bomb and a cap stash. Move, McCready. Oh, man. This thing was blown to bits. Oh, oh. Hey, that looked like it hurt. That was easy. We only have one more super mutant to kill, and then we can grab uh, the magazine. And I believe this is a tumblers today, which will make lock picking easier for us. I wonder where this train is headed. I doubt there's much track left for it to run on. Let's press this button. It'll move the train so that we can go in it. Let's turn on our Pip-Boy lamp. Press this button as well. Grab the Day Tripper. Ooh, right away. And then the magazine. Nice. Tumblers today. Now we can get out of the West uh, Roxbury, I think it's Roxbury uh, station. And then I think we're going to be heading to, oh, almost missed my turn here. Uh, we're gonna be heading to Shaw High School. 
So let's uh, head there now. We'll crouch before we head out. Turn off our lamp. See everybody on the other side. I don't know why I decided to crouch. There are usually enemies up that way and off to the left where you see all those buildings as well. So actually, yeah, let's keep crouching. I really don't want to alert any enemies unless necessary. Go inside Shaw High School. What? Who's there? Nobody's here. <laughs> Swear I swear I'm over this. Oh my god, McCready. Impressed yet? If they come at us, we'll kill them. For now, if you come over here, there's a cap stash. It's kind of difficult to get, but yeah. Let's uh, lock pick the door. Sweet. Good job. But can you do a blindfold? And then we're gonna lock pick the uh, desk right here as well. That's it. Grab out the library key. That's just gonna make our life easier. If you want, you can no, lockpick that door. There today. is a ton of Mintats in there. Which uh, kind of correlates with the story uh, or lore of this school. We'll pick up a holotape and listen to it. And you'll see why uh, there's just so many Mintats in this school. I smelled your fear! Jeez. He was a tough boy, wasn't he? I think there's one more down there. But I'm not really worried about him. Let's uh, open up the library door. Take that out. Be careful for the frag mine. Be careful of the handmade tension trap. Or not tension trap, uh, trip wire. Okay. Uh. Oh, 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 God. Blindless human. Then we'll pick up the unstoppables. Bingo. So now we're up to four. I think we have one more. Yeah. Also, there's some it's overdue books here. Human. Just in case you still have not got enough overdue books. Let's go ahead and listen to this hollow tape and then we'll get out of Shaw High School. All right, Burton. I'm here. Hurry up. Out with it. I have a lot of plans for this summer and none of them involve chatting with you. Why, Ronald, I'm hurt. Skipping the pleasantries and getting right down to business. And after all we've accomplished together this semester. For the last time, you little snot, it's Principal Tanner. Fine, Principal Tanner. I'll make this quick. You've been giving me Mentas to distribute to the students quietly and under the nose of the faculty. I have. Because of this, test scores have skyrocketed. The school board has noticed. We received quite an increase in funding. But the faculty doesn't know. No one here knows except you. And now... You've been skimming off the top and pocketing most of the funds. I want 50% of what you're embezzling. We'll go to Superintendent Marcella with this. What? How did you... When did you get so smart? You've been giving me brain pills every week. What did you expect, you pathetic little man? Well, so what if it's all true? No one's going to believe you. You're just a kid, and I'm the principal, and more importantly, an adult. Oh, I think they'll believe me, Ronald. Especially after they hear you admit everything in your own words. What are you talking about? 
Wait. Is that a hollow tape? You son of a Let's go ahead and head to Jamaica Plains. Let's be careful that we don't attract any enemies here. Top ourselves off. Mm, I already see an enemy. So we can sneak past him. I don't think we're going to be able to. Bring caution. Well, all right. Yeah, we snuck past him. Sweet. Now let's clear out <laughs> some of these ghouls here in Jamaica Plains. Oh if you clear out all the ghouls in Jamaica Plains, you can get a settlement. It's a pretty cool settlement. I like it. Step back here. Now just starting to have fun. Oh, come on, we're here. Don't tell me you actually believe that. We're gonna be heading over to the town hall here in a minute, but. First, I want to clear out some of these ghouls so they're not a problem and grab an ID card. Mm, I don't see another ghoul over here. Oh, there he is. Of course. Feral over here. That's how we do things around here. Find him! Find him! Oh, missed him. Some more. Wolves aren't so bad if they're at a distance, but as soon as they get up and up close and personal, it's where they can really mess you up. We're splitting all that, right? Nope, it's all mine, McCready. I thought we uh already established this, bud. There is a ton of ghouls over here. I know they're going to come running after me in a minute. <clears throat> of course. What a waste of time. We're going to go over to this church. But we have to go in the, I think it's a red house right next to it. Let's take out this school too. And then there's one more right here. If I can quit missing them. Okay, Jesus. Like Holy Jeebus. Ah, it is a red house. See, I knew it. I knew it. There's going to be some ghouls in here too. Kind of clear them out. Mm, iguana bits, nah. Be all right. Should be another one somewhere around here. Oh, there he is. <laughs> he was caught up on the uh, flooring there. I was about to say rafters, but that would be wrong. There's two ways of going about this. You can hop your way up there and then hop to the steeple. Or you can be really, really careful and fall down right here. It's up to you. If you want to play it safe, just hop to the top there, come down the steeple, and uh, come through here.
this dead guy over here, which is named Luke Silverhand, is the person that we want. It's got the Jamaica Plain Mayor's ID. That's going to help us out. There's some more ghouls in this house. Um, and the workbench is actually inside the red brick building. This won't take long. Trying to get through there. Nice military grade duct tape. Up another kill from me. Give us some ballistic fiber. Have a few more ghouls to clear out up top here. I think there's one down there too, but. I have some piss poor shooting today, don't I? Nice. I mean, not something I'm going to use just because I don't like to have low health, but still pretty cool. This right here is what we want. The Jamaica Plain Mayor's password and Sal's hollow tape. We'll go ahead and listen to that in just a second. Go into our inventory. Ah, oh, there it is. Damn it, worthless bastards. Scattered like brad roaches the moment they saw their first ghoul. I've spent months prepping for this op. There's no way I'm backing out now. That treasure will be mine. Even if I have to dig it up with my own bare hands. So now we have to find the treasure of Jamaica Plains or plain. I don't know. I like saying plural Plains, Jamaica Plains. Ah, that's where that ghoul was safe right here. You can lock pick if you so choose or you can hack into the terminal and unlock it yourself. I'm not worried about it. It's not a big deal, but more importantly, you're gonna have to uh, uh, lock pick this door. Garbage. That's it. Looks like you've done that a few. Over there is the janitor's office. Just stuff to loot over there. Welcome to the treasures of Jamaica Plain. Identification acknowledged. Welcome, Mayor. You are clear to proceed. Let's go through here and then we're gonna go into the terminal. Someone already found the treasure and now they're hoarding it here. So if you don't have the password, these protectrons are gonna wake up, you're gonna press this button, and they're gonna shoot you from behind. So just keep that in mind. Come on, come on, 
It's almost too funny not to laugh about. And then we're going to grab the special bat here. Bingo. World Series bat. Uh, this is just stuff that you can read. The treasures inventory. Let's listen to the holo tape. Welcome to the treasures of Jamaica Plain. Within the walls of this time capsule, you, our descendants, will find the items and mementos we treasured in the year 2077. To you, 200 years in the future, these relics may seem quaint, but we hope that they will remind you of our place in history and your own. As we laid the foundation for the world in which you live, so you too will lay a foundation for future generations. May that future be bright. On behalf of all of us in 2077, we wish you well. This is Mayor Alyssa Park speaking for the town of Jamaica Plain. Uh, it was just a time capsule. Womp, womp, womp. Although we did get a, a legendary weapon out of it, so it's not so bad. Let's go back out the door to the Commonwealth. Now we just have one more stop. Did not mean to try to lockpick that. And I think in the next one, we're just going to continue trying to get everything looted in South Boston. Uh, besides where the Glowing Sea is. The Glowing Sea, I'll probably save to close close to whenever the uh, walkthrough is wrapping up. I thought that was a wicked uh, shipping. I guess not. But we're going over here. We're going to crouch again. There's going to be quite a few raiders over here we're going to take out. I believe this is going to be the last Grognak the Barbarian magazine that we're going to need. I think, I think after this we'll have collect all of them. Collected all of them. I can't stand getting wet. Well, McCready, good thing I know a route where we don't have to walk in the water. Aren't I a nice guy? No, oh, God, the Brotherhood of Steel. Come on, guys. <laughs> uh. Who's there? And they're probably going to crash on our head again. Let's hope not. Maybe they'll be a good distraction for them. Who knows? Think you can win this? Huh? Let's just try to make our way through this section as best as we can with the Brotherhood of Steel messing a lot of this up. Be careful for this, by the way. Grenades up here. <laughs> Where did I just get shot from? Are you serious? Somebody's a really good shot if they shot me through the window. What the hell? Maybe it was you. Bastard, die. Be careful for the frag grenade. You take the wrong day to piss me off. Yeah, I knew there was a dog around here somewhere. I heard him. I just did not see him. Ooh, nice. Did I I really got him from that distance? That that was pretty sweet. Not gonna lie. Where the hell am I being shot from? Seriously though. This shouldn't take long. Let's heal ourselves. Ah! <coughs> Just 
Just top ourselves off. Oh, you're a legendary, aren't you? Die, fool. Nah. Nothing I really want. Just want to take out these raiders really quick. Of course. Stupid dog. Oh, come on. You are everywhere. And I heard a robot. Oh, good God. How many fucking dogs are there in here? Holy shit, another dog. Kyle. We killed the poor dog, Kyle. But if Kyle wouldn't have fucking tried to eat us... Where am I being shot from? Wow, down there. Come on. So many. <laughs> so many fucking raiders. Let's loot this trunk. And then right over here is our grognak. Perfect. Pretty cool cover. Back here, if you want to. Playing games with me, huh? Time's up. Lock pick that chest. Feel free. Die, bastard. I think that's everybody. Yeah. Let's just go ahead and end the video here before anything else happens. Oh, good God. Now let's end the video. I just did not want to deal with that. Oh, and the sun's setting. It's really pretty. Put our weapon away. All right, everybody, I want to tell you all thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe. And like always, everybody, have a great morning, afternoon, night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.